Hey all, and welcome back to Super Mario 3D World Bowser's Fury. We're basically halfway through the game now with these 25 cat shines of ours, so uh, let's see if we can't finish it in this session. And then Tanner and I can get back to the uh, TV movie com and quick book grind. It's been nice doing, you know, a, a full complete playthrough of something, but we also got all those to get through. Mm hmm. I can't believe they called it Fury Shadow. Alright, so. Uh, yeah, there we go. Haha! <laughs> Taste projectiles, facsimile of mine brother. Oh, he doesn't like it. Thankfully, my uh, adopted child is on it. <laughs> he is he is relentlessly pursuing him. Also, sick jump off of him. Thank you. Dead planet? But you know, that's just how these things work. I did maybe 20% of that. Hey, but that 20% is what matters. Hey, <laughs> you can tell I'm the boss of the group, can't you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, beautiful. Never mind Mount Doom in the background there. This is actually a nice place. Alright, uh, just some cat tokens now. Yeah, grab those. Definitely worth it to get the quickest and easiest um, shine right away to get rid of the goo, because the goo is not fun. Here's a hint from the lighthouse. If you want to avoid the Beast's Fury Blast, find some cover to hide behind. Ah, uh, ah, uh, cool. Yeah, we know this. <laughs> Disaster strikes. I actually didn't want to do that. I want to go on top of the thing, because on the top of each lighthouse, there's a little secret for you. Oh, it is shining. Aw, oh, look at that. Just in case you need it. I thought I was still a Tanuki. It's fine. <laughs> Different mammal altogether. Full disclosure, this is the start of a recording session. As you can probably tell by me introducing the thing, so it'll take a while to just re-acclimatize. I have been playing that fucking Sonic Forces speed battle all afternoon. Uh, sigh. <laughs> the mobile game grind, man. It's how it is. All I'm saying, man, is if I win a hard-won battle and go up 20 points, I should not then lose the next one and lose 25 points. That's all I'm saying. I'm just throwing it out there. Ooh, the economy. <laughs> that works on multiple levels. Mm-hmm. Because it's a mobile game, and you know what they do for the economy. I have not paid a single cent, I'm happy to say. I am not planning to pay a single cent, I'm happy to say. Unless, of course, I get really desperate, and I want Excalibur Sonic. <laughs> okay, but that's who I would put money in for. Like, I I'm thinking, like, is there any Sonic character that I would actually, like, put money in for? And not really, but Excalibur Sonic? Yeah, this is the coolest thing. Got these... Catfish, ha ha ha. Ha Bit disturbing. Uh, I, I do recommend if you're ever in a bad mood, just go onto the Mario uh, wiki there and just look up the list of everything that's been catified. Uh, there's some good ones on there and also some terrifying ones. Things that should not have fur that do. Hmm. Right, where is Bowser exactly? Is he coming out anytime soon? Um... I don't even see him right now. We'll know if it starts to rain for sure. Well, we could just be entering bread. You don't know. <laughs> it's true. Now, is this the way we came in? I'm not entirely sure. I'm not really sure, but uh, if we loop around to an older level, there'll be new stuff anyway, so it's all good. That's what I want to see out of a future 3D Mario. Levels that constantly evolve and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, I want to definitely see, like, a reason to go back to an earlier level. I mean, I, I know people love being able to just, like, you know, complete a level entirely in one go, but I do really like how this is just like, hey, did you come back to a, another area? You're all good, just get going. Did I do this one? I think because it's, yeah, I think it's uh, transparent there. We got this one. Balls to that, then. We can just ignore it. Interesting. I see a blue switch there. Also, why? No! You can't do this to me! It's trying to get you. 
Well, that's actually kind of nice that it shows you exactly where to go. You watch, there's going to be like a hole or something. Oh, there absolutely will be. Not really helpful right now, uh, Junior. <laughs> no, that was a distraction, if anything, buddy. I'm actually trying to do my big boy jumps, thank you. There we go. Alright, take two. Junior, if you could pick these up too, that'd actually be kind of helpful. Nope, I only hurt people. Violence is all that he knows. Alright, just run, just run. Swear to God, if I missed any of those, I was going to be furious. Speaking of furious... Ah. Uh, here we come. Can you pause the timer, please? While, we, while Bowser gets his rage out? No, in fact, it goes twice as fast. No! It's okay, this is probably going to be a two for anyone. Mm, we'll see. So very cool. Yep, do it. Hey! We must send him away. Be gone! Foul turtle demon. That's right, a single lighthouse. Look at him in the background. Oh, I see what's coming. I don't like this shit. Oh, the light, my eyes! Gamera is not friend to all children in this world. With him spinning in his shell and flying through the air, that is absolutely a reference to Gamera. Like, a hundred percent. Ah, sure. Fire. Why not? It's nice to have. I remember you guys from, uh, Captain Toad's levels. Mm hmm They had- some of them had very long heads there. They sure did. Clash with Cat Boom Boom. Okay. You're a fucker is what you are. I think that was Bowser Jr. who swiped it into you too. <laughs> you motherfucker. Hey, here we go. That's pretty cool. He barely looks different. Uh, he does have a little bit of fur if you look carefully. His skin is changed from scaly to furry. Oh yeah, I was watching uh, KZX play a bit of this and uh, he zoomed in on the Koopas with fur textures on their skin and I was not happy about it. It's kind of disturbing, honestly. I'm not the biggest fan. That's what uh, a cat calendar does to a motherfucker, I suppose. Nice. Had this whole arena built for him. I kill him in like five seconds. I see some tokens, though, here, too. Ah, uh, that's what I like. You do a thing, there's already a new goal on the horizon. Yeah, fuck off. What is that? That's a rabbit. Interesting. Well, we'll get to that in a minute. There's uh, stuff to do here first. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Hello. There's one. Those little, like, uh, slanted ca cat platforms there really remind me of um, the little blocks that let you run vertical in Mario World. Yes, I kind of, I kind of see what you're saying. Uh, right, because it's just like it's a little angular platform that basically says, "Hey, you want to run up here? You know you do." Ooh, maybe I do, Mister Man. Maybe I do. I didn't really see any more from uh, where we were standing. Well, we get a good vantage point up here. Yeah, down on the thing above. Mm-hmm. Every game needs a photo mode now. I mean. 
I'm not against it per se. Ha, <laughs> per se. <laughs> never, never laugh like that again. All right. <laughs> so you got one in the very far middle. I think you can use the little spring thing on the other side to get that. Oh, brilliant! From A to B, just like boing. There it is. Okay, you have to press forward. That's interesting. I would assume that, like, pulling it back and letting go would fling it. Yeah, it's usually how it works, but honestly, it's probably for the best because it's so easy to accidentally do that. I don't see any more when I was down here. Well, there's the. We didn't really go around the outside of the island a lot here. That's true. Oh. Go on, Plessy. Might be in a tree. Might want to try climbing up one of them. Well, there's one. You cheeky bastard. Just one left. If you see it, kids, shout! Shout like your lives depend on it! Oh boy, he do be running. His movement. It's maxed out. He's got the deeks. That fucking lift up. Yeah, I was just gonna say. What? How? Why does it relate to the phase of Bowser or something? I guess we'll never know. Well, now we can probably go in there and look and see if there's a uh, another way to get in. Yeah, because now, now if we can get in uh, this way here... There might be a way to get the uh, last coin. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Cat Pom Pom's counterattack. So not the one we were looking for, but it's good to keep uh, sh movement going, I suppose. Yeah, and you know what? I bet you it opened up because we like we left, and now it can get ready for the second mission. Uh, memories of, uh, Champion's Run. You could probably just ground pound that block and it'll probably open up. You know what, Tana? You're absolutely right. Mm-hmm. Good. Much better. I wonder if the last token is in here. That's what I'm thinking. Now that it's raised, I bet you it's down at the bottom or something. I mean, you were already kind of kawaii anyway, so it sort of suits you. Yeah, she was already got that teenage girl sort of thing going on, so just add cat ears, and now she's a, a, a trendy teenage girl. They love the cat ears now. There you go. You tried, Bowser Jr., but I got all the KOs this time. You choose violence, but today violence chose us. Is that how we got in? Oh, you know what? It is... It is near the arena. What, inside the arena? Yeah, as in, like, the, the middle platform we were just fighting on? Do a quick r 180 around it. There it is. Cheeky bastards. That's Insomniac tier collection hiding. Yeah, we don't have a Miles Morales radar for this one. No, we don't. I don't have the swagger. That's my problem. <laughs> nope. Ah, so we're only missing 17 now, and then the game's done. Yeah, I think if we leave and come back, there is another mission we can do. We don't have to be waiting till the end of the game. Or, there are blast blocks here as well. Whereabouts, mate? Uh, the blast blocks are on the outside of the stadium. Okay. Oh lord, the apocalypse has started. I'm just going for a swim. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> just this little cat doing his little... I mean, I was going to say doggy paddle, but that probably feels like it's a... Not, they don't like to hear that. Yeah, just swim around till we find those blocks. Woohoo! What's the dive button again? Oh my Jesus. There we go. I found it. Oh, there's some right beside you. To your right. I see him, Tata. Oi, fucko. You know you want to breathe fire. Okay, so this is apparently not hot enough. Okay, you're close enough now, I think. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thankfully, he got bored. I mean, don't leave on my behalf. Nice. Oh, jeez. I swear if one of these doesn't have a cloud. I'm watching you. Okay. Just to be careful. You did it just to be careful. Bring. Come on. Okay, so that one was tilt back and release. Interesting. There you are. Yeah. I said it's more evil over here. Yeah, you can tell that it's been uh, changed up because the goo is back on top of the lighthouse, meaning that a new mission is now here. Hmm. Show's over, Cat Magic Hoopers. Look at him! Jesus. I love him. I love him so much. Sorry, I just had to scrape cap that for posterity. The best thing is, their official name, according to the Mario Wiki, is Cat Little Birds. <sighs> I'm shaking my head. <laughs> just adorable. Oh, I see what the rub is here. Y'all ain't shit. GGZ easy. And now only remain 15 of the buggers. Yeah, so that's this island completely done, as there is five on every island, which you can tell by the five buttons going up the lighthouse. Ah, that's such a nice little aesthetic feature to help you. I'm going to have so much fun 100%ing this after the playthrough is done. Oh yeah, especially because there are some pretty meaty 100% rewards for this. Uh, more so than most Mario games would have. Jesus. Hello. Whoa, drifting. Alright, if we ever get a Mario Warriors game, there has to be a plessy weapon that you can just drift around slaughtering Goombas with. Oh, absolutely. That was the one that was missing. Yeah! Neat. What was the mission that popped up, then? Oh, uh, that, that was the one. It was the five cat tokens. So I think if you leave and come back immediately, then the last one will proc. Uh, where's Plessy? Hello. I think if you just run into, like, the water, oh. Plessy will always show up. Plessy's always got your back. Just gotta wait for the, uh, the tower to be gooed up again.
Anything here? Or are we done here? I think this one has the um, the flag, meaning it is all done. Yep, that one's done, that one's done, and yes, the goo is back on the first level. You bastards, I turn my back for one second. <laughs> and you just look over at Bowser Jr. and he's like, it's not me this time. Okay, so we need uh, Bowser for this one. Ball in! I used this a couple times in the multiplayer. The only problem was, you're a hitbox that hurts everyone, and uh, that's not good for multiplayer. Also, it goes away after a time, so... Yeah, you get dizzy after a little bit. Anyway, instead of waiting for him, let's go do something else. Yeah, there is the ice level there that uh, looks to have another. Uh, I'm getting blue coin PTSD. Nothing can be as bad as the blue coins here. KZ did it in one fucking go. I was so mad. It's how it goes. Uh, what you got for me here? We gotta get on up. Key to the cat shrine. Really, no, no need for us to take the boot. We can just platform around. That's what it wants us to do anyway. Yeah, because we're not going to be able to even use the boot when we get the key. I'm assuming it's this way. Otherwise, I'm just going for a nice walk. Yeah, it's, I mean, I would assume it'd be, you know, a place so that then we can try and make our way back through the level. Ah, yep, there it is. Nice. So now, we just gotta try and make our way back up, it seems. Oh, you bastards, they took away the pipe. Oh, I remember this one. So there is, yeah, it's gonna show you over here. There is a side path. Very cool. Yeah, you take care of that Bowser Jr. if you could. Yeah, swap the bees away. See, I love this because, like, you would have never... You would have never needed this side area. Uh, except for this exact platforming challenge. I love that idea. Exactly. It's just... What's the word I'm looking for? Economical use of level design? I think the I think the phrase is emergent level design, which is you know good good game developer words. Okay, well you're the teacher. I'll take your word for it. Every now and then I get to talk about game development stuff and as as a teacher, and it's always fun. Well, I mean, there's like every facet of the curriculum in there. You have mathematics. There's a bit of science in there as well. English. I'm sure there's PE if you really wanted to uh, make like a Mario Assault course for kids to run. Okay, we I actually made a gym game called Mario Kart where like people are in the middle being chain chomps, basically playing dodgeball while everyone else runs laps. It's pretty fun. Neat. I say that as a 33-year-old man-child. Very cool. <laughs> All right, Lotto. I hear him. Whoa. Yeah, might as well head on back. The slowest fall ever. That dive doesn't last very long. No, it's not. It's it's literally like a temporary get away from stuff. There's the blocks. No, Blessy! Blessy, no! <laughs> I'm not that evil. Right, where you is? Oh my Jesus. What a great screenshot. What a good screenshot. Taste cat shine, you overgrown ox turtle. That, did you just get possessed by a demon? Possibly. Oh, I hate you furries anyway, Emma. Yeah, he's he's more on the side of scalies rather than furries. Mm. 
So much degeneracy in Mario now, there is. <laughs> so much. Very cool. Alright, uh, I guess we'll go find a new island now, since this one's done and dusted. Well, the ice one is back to being all there, and then we got uh, the final one in the Colosseum as well. See, this is what I love. It's just like, go here, do something else. Oh, there's something I can do. Let's go do it. I love that. Hello. Kill them all, Peter. I will. Mario's name is now Peter. Fuck that guy in particular. <laughs> Thanks, Junior. Jesus, only 11 left. So do we need to leave for our new ones to activate? No, that was actually not the ice level. This was a just a regular general Lake Laplace uh, one to get to. Okay. I understand it was a hard sentence to say, mate. Don't worry about it. Oh, this isn't just another Fury Blocks one. So where were the Fury Blocks here? I don't actually know. I'm going to assume at the end, but yeah, we should at least look for them there. So that we know to pop it when we need to. Hmm. Hello. Why are you leading me up here, exactly? I think it's more because whenever you get to the end, uh, like you get to the last one of the cat shines, they just put these in the level so you can easily get around them with no worries. That's just silly looking. That's bizarre. Can you... Can you zoop up while on the skate? Family photo. Right, keep your eyes and your peepers open. Both of those are the same thing. That's a synonym, boys and girls. Today I am the teacher. For this fraction of a second. It's over now. Yeah, check like check like behind here. Ruins Gigabout. Ah. Ah, there we go. I'd like to get out of this if I may. Well, might as well go to the Coliseum and do that one, and then once Bowser's good to go, we can run back here. Bad hops. <laughs> this is... I love it. I love just seeing you zip around on it. Boom Boom, what, what are you realistically gonna do here? Uh, he was gonna boom, and then he's going to boom. Okay. Oh. Good. I don't think I can pick them up. I think you gotta get hit to lose it. Junior, please. Junior, please! Oh, you know what? I bet you if you fall in the water, it'll probably get lost. Good point. We are smart. I always get too big for my britches. Just go with the jumps you were given, Tom. You probably want to hit those and then go do the bomb. Thanks, buddy. Thank you, Junior. Very cool. That worked. Oh my god. Mm, slight difficulty upgrade. I mean, you can also use the um, the lucky cat suit to just turn invincible when you ground pound. True. Sure. 
<laughs> what are you gonna do now, buddy? Well, you put up a Valiant 5, but I had a couple of those stocked away, so poo on you. I wonder what the final one for this place is. I think it's the Fury Blocks. Right, right. I, you can literally see it behind you right there on your right. That message is ringing out. When the beast awakens, so shall I. Oh, yeah, there is. So we can come back here later once Bowser's activated, but uh, when he does it this time, he won't be able to be quelled by that, so we're going to need the, uh, the Giga Bell. Jesus. Hmm. What can we do in the meantime? Uh, well, I, I would probably just start looking around for a Giga Bell, because here it's time. Oh, shit. Oh, shouldn't I let him get rid of these first? Uh, yeah, you could do that for sure. Yeah, we're here. Might as well. Not yet, good sir. Not yet. Something so terrifying about a bell tolling and the cat sounding at the same time. Thank you. Nintendo really loves their tall, round coliseums, huh? So did the Romans, I would think. Wow. No, that's totally what it's a reference to. You're super right. No, Miyamoto came up with this back in 1965. And then an Italian went back in time. <laughs> to try and supersede the Japanese. Of course. Oh, locks. <laughs> 